Hey everyone, it's Allison here. So for the comments, I got 45 comments. Whew. So I tried filming it and it cut me off. So I'm going to have to maybe make this in two parts. So I'll try and see what I can do. From Princess Jazzy 99 do you make your pictures out of duct tape? Um, yes, I sometimes make them out of duct tape, but um, people, if they want them cheaper, then I make them out of plastic. I mean paper I print them out because that's actually like that you can get two to three dollars off your purchase if you do um, paper instead of real duct tape just kind of depends the design some designs don't even cost extra from dream big and small who's your favorite duct taper we got always gonna be proud of your work so I'm gonna go for me as my favorite duct taper I hope it doesn't sound wrong <laughs> but you know you gotta be proud of yourself you guys should all be your favorite duct tapers if you make duct tape then don't sell yourself short Unless you really suck at wallets, then, yeah, that was kind of mean. Um, I actually like a, like a lot of duct tapers, and I couldn't narrow it down, so. Dream big and small. How old are you? I'm 17. Again, dream big and small. How do you do your logo? Um, and Lynn Nayliger also asked that question. Uh, Martin from Metal actually made my logo, and... A lot of people use him because, like, he he asked to make me one, and then, like, everyone was like, oh, my gosh, where'd you get that? So now everyone else has one. So it's pretty cool. Go check him out. Um, he's so awesome. From Jordan DW 32 how are you so awesome? Ha, ha. I don't know. How are you so awesome, Jordan? Duck, t duck yourself. How do you do the AW impression on the pocket? Come on, people. Just look at it. I saw this. Think, what happens when you put something underneath duct tape? That's what happened with me. Came up with a cool idea. Give me credit if you use it, if you figure it out. It's not that hard. You guys can do it. 11 game face. What is the measurement for the woven pouch slash clutch? I don't really have an exact measurement, but it's about 8 inches by 6 inches. 8.5 by 6 inches. Um... The, the clutch, I use a smaller version, so it's about six and a half by five inches, maybe. Um, there are different measurements you can get for the clutch, like have a large clutch and a small clutch. And then I just kind of guesstimate on each one, so sorry about not being able to give an exact number. But normally, uh, this, the, um, can't think, the width is normally always six inches. And then the length will vary from like um, nine to eight inches, so it kind of varies. Um, how much time do I have left? Awesome. Where was I? From 11 Game Face and, oh yeah, how do you make this, oh I already answered that one, Martin from Metal. And then I already answered the one again from 11 Game Face about the logo. How do you make your logo? From Tonka123, no, to Tonka123, dude. Uh, Martin from Metal. Makes my logo. From the same person, Tatanka123, dude, where do you get your plastic? Right now I'm using secret plastic, and I can't tell anyone because so far I think I'm the only person on YouTube, well, duct tape community that uses it. So I don't really want to tell anyone because it, it's what sets me apart, like what will keep you buying my wallets and stuff. Um, you can go to Staples, get plastic. That's what I recommend. I also sell plastic. Um, it's a dollar for one sheet, and tell me your measurements, and I'll cut it up for you. And yeah, and normally you can get like 10 IDs out of a sheet of plastic, which is a great deal. Um, from Duct Tape 14, what does your face look like? I have a nose, a mouth, two eyes, cheeks, um, a forehead, and a chin. So it kind of looks like that. Where do you get your plastic? Duct Tape Galore. Staples. What are your measurements? And then that was from Braden's Wallets. And then Fetsco34 also asked, um, what are your bifold wallet measurements? Bifolds. We have eight by three. Trifolds. Eight or sometimes seven and seven eighths. Sometimes eight and one fourth by always three and three fourths. So kind of depends. What mood I'm feeling in that day, you know what I mean? No, just kidding. Um, it just actually depends how well I cut. So, <laughs> um, where do you get your exacto knife? I got mine from Michaels, but it's not really about the knife. It's really about the blades inside the knife. 
um, which there's actually a question about that later, so I'll talk to you about that later. You can get exact nice from Michaels, um, Lowe's, Walmart, Joann's, any craft store, just go in. If you go into Walmart and ask where the X-Acto knives are, Walmart stores a really good X-Acto knife, actually. Um, how do you, how did you get into making wallets from Steph Dat Girl? Um, I saw someone making a wallet online, and it was really expensive, and it wasn't that well made, so, and I thought I can do better than that. So, I did. And now look at me, which is pretty good, because I didn't really plan on selling them until I saw that people were willing to buy. And I thought if I got good enough, I could probably buy. I mean, I could probably sell them. And that's just what I did. Duct tape yourself. What are your measurements for your wallet? So I already answered that one. From Linda Leaguer. How do you press your wallets? Good question, actually. Um, trifolds. I like to put a little something heavier on them, like my laptop or an amp. Um, if you have a MacBook Pro, then you know those things can get pretty heavy. So I like put that on top for the night. Um, for pressing them, press them for a few hours. That's definitely something that I recommend. Um, if you have a guitar amp, that works so well because I have an amp and if you, you know how heavy those are if you have one. So I put them under there. Anything works if you want to pile up duct tape. Um, if you have something, you can sleep on them actually. That I never thought about that. But if you like put them under your pillow, I bet that would be a good way to press it. Or if you're sitting in the car. Sometimes when I sit in the car and I have a new wallet I just made, like this big guy. This actually isn't newly made, so it stays on really nicely. I actually like sat on it, put it under your leg. I don't sit on it with my butt because that's just weird, but like I put my leg underneath it. Um, how much time do I have left? Ah, I'm nervous it's gonna cut me off again. That um from Candy Lover28. Where do you get your plastic? Staples, Walmart, you can get it anywhere. Prankster2215. Um, he says that he loves watching speed up vids and he wants to know if I can make another video with my dog. And I will, because that was really fun. He also asked from Prankster2215, can you make a coin pouch tutorial? I will totally make one. I actually really want to. He also asked, how are your wallets clean and straight? And also, how do you have no fold over lines? Um, you got to practice. Go slowly. got to kind of, when you put the tape down, actually don't go too slowly, if this makes sense. Just plot, put it down in one movement and then push. Push from the center. Like, push it out, you know? Um, no fold over lines. I don't do this because I like to, um, I do it a different way, my little secret way. It took me like five months to come up with. So, I know. I worked really hard on it. That's why I don't want to tell people. It's just like one of those things. So I hope you guys don't get angry. Um, to get, just throw a piece of tape over it. It really helps. That's what I used to do. From Duct Tape Dude 43 can you please make a bracelet tutorial? Yours are really good. I actually think the duct tape guy is making one. So, I'll let you guys know when he does. Um, how do you do very cleanly, from Tanner's B11, how do you very cleanly have zero fold over lines because your wallets just look amazing? Answered that one, but yeah, just throw some tape over it. How do you get your X-Acto knife to work good? Mine doesn't cut well, and I just got it from Lowe's. That's from Miss Kelzo Wilk. Buy one of these. This is, well, it doesn't come with duct tape on it. I just do that to hold the lens in. Um, X-Acto knife blade uh, dispenser. You get these at Michael's. Go to Michael's. This was my old one. Comes with tons of blades. Go to Michael's and ask for where the X-Acto knives are. You'll see something that looks like this. It'll be in something like this. Go there and get it. These are the best blades. These are so sharp, so nice. Be careful. You have to be 14 and up. That's how intense they are. So please be careful with them, but I totally recommend them. They are great blades. Um, how do you prevent a lot of wrinkles on the inside of trifolds? You've got to cut these little notches in. Like That'll help you so well. I know a lot of people complain about them. But no one even knew that I did them. Because I, you just little ones like this. See, you can barely see them, but they help so well. Look, no wrinkles. It helps just like relieve the tension and pressure. So that's just advice I have. Where do you store all of your duct tape? I have this really big container. I'll make a video of that. 
that was from, oh, Harry Sandals asked me about the wrinkles. Renee Lay Louis something asked me about the container. Um, how do you get no air bubbles down when we place clear tape from 12 Charlie 20? I'm going to have a tutorial on that on Everything Duck, so I'll let you know when that's up. From Lene Leaguer, where do you get your plastic? Stay wells. XX duct tape, dude XX. Could I cut a trading card holder in half, use it as a D slot? Totally use those. That'd be great plastic. You should really, really use that. I'm not even kidding. Like, that'd be really good plastic. From duct tape fan 0 how do you get no fold over lines? And how do you attach a ziplock? And maybe if you wanna, how do you your wallet so thin? I'm not gonna show how I get my wallet so thin because, you know, like, I work so hard. It's like my trade thing. That's something I came up with, and I was like, yay. So, um, th I won't do anything on that soon, but I might in the future. Um, I'm going to show how to attach a Ziploc because I'm going to do that with when I show about like coin pouches and stuff. I'm going to show how to attach a coin pouch to a wallet. So, hope that helps. CCX2, Thema X12. Just wondering, answer if you want, but how old are you? I'm 17. Three more minutes. Candy Star 15. Where do you get the Ziplocs? Walmart. Cat Girl 224, what are fold over lines? The lines that fold over. Cat Suzy 99, how do you make your wallet so thin? Magic. LC Aaron, how do you make perfect Ziploc coin purse? The tutorial. Uh, Miley 427247, how do you make your wallet so perfect? Why, well, thank you that you think them they're perfect. It just kind of happens. How do you prevent a lot of wrinkles on the inside of your trifold? Sponsor stuck to tape answered that one. Brandon's wallets. How long have you been making wallets and how old are you? I've been making wallets for less than a year now and I'm 17. Duct tape rules. One, how do you make your wallets with no fold over lines? Throw some tape on it, girlfriend. You got that. Actually, that's probably a guy. Friend. <laughs> um, and that was from duct tape rules. One. I finished it in less than four, it's 15 minutes, so sorry this was long. If you have any other questions, I'd love to do this again. This was totally fun, so um, for next time, I, you can, if you have any unanswered questions, but I hope you don't, um, you can put them down there, and hopefully I'll be able to uh, explain more and do a better video. So I hope this helped you guys. So get these for your X-Acto knives. You can get X-Acto knives at Lowe's, Staples, um, Actually, I'm not sure about Staples. Lowe's, Michaels, and Walmart. You get these at Michaels. They work so well. If you don't have a Michaels, go to any craft store. They will have these. Any Lowe's will have these. Just go ask for, ask for X-Acto knife for replacement blades. Plastic, go to Staples. You have to, like, that's the only good place I've seen. Um, get, they have actually plastic sheet covers and all the plastic is out and you can go and feel that um i recommend ticket covers fire file folders and um project protectors those are some good ones um if you have any other questions let me know so that was just a recap i gotta go i'm running out of time peace